Hey, I'm Kyle Scott, the owner of Surf and Turf Roofing and Gutters. And for the next two weeks only, we're giving a massive 25% discount on all of our services. From skylight installations, chimney repairs, soft washes, roof repairs, roof replacements, gutters and gutter guards. Get the quality you'll love at the price you deserve. Don't miss this limited time offer. Call now or visit surfandturfroofing.com to get your free consultation. Still a below average day. Temperatures managed to briefly make it into the low 50s this afternoon and this morning. We continue to sit in the low to mid 30s. But as we head into the overnight hours, temperatures gradually start to fall back into those 30s. Right now we're sitting in the middle 40s for most between 44 and 47. But once again, mid to upper 30s for tonight. We could see a few areas of clouds passing by, but it should be mostly clear and quiet for the overnight hours with an exception to the gusty winds. Winds gusting right now between 35 to 40 miles an hour for some spots, especially closer to the beaches where there's not as much surface friction to block the air movement. So that's why we are seeing higher gusts near the shore. But winds continue to stay gusty overnight between 25 and 30 miles an hour. Then throughout tomorrow afternoon, we continue to see gusty winds between 20, 25 miles an hour, some spots up to about 30 at times, but we'll gradually start to scale back as we head into tomorrow night. Winds finally starting to relax as that upper level trough continues to pull further away from the area. So that's a good sign that we will finally see these gusty winds kind of start to relax. But into tomorrow, we're once again in the low 50s, gusty winds for the afternoon, but gradually scaling back as we head into the evening, mostly sunny skies, and it should be mostly clear overnight for tomorrow. Then warmer temperatures on the way as we head towards your Monday and Tuesday. We're back up into the low 60s. Uh, but then another system looks to come wreck our Thanksgiving Day plans because it's going to be another cool, blustery, and rainy turkey day. That's what it's looking like right now. There's still time for change, but go ahead and start planning for some unpleasant weather conditions for turkey day. And we look to stay chilly even as we head into next weekend, only staying in the low 40s.